Ronin and Venom Goblin are probably the two hardest villains in the game right now. And they're especially hard for True Solo. Uh, they will punish you. They will wreck your hero constantly. And it's not always a lot of fun. But sometimes you just want to beat up on those villains, right? So recently over on twitch.tv backslash d20 we're working, we did a live stream, which if you're not part of that community, you should go over there, hit the follow button, all that fun stuff. Uh, we recently did a live stream where we showed how strong a rush aggression deck strategy can be. Um, not everyone does this or knows about it. Some people consider it kind of cheating because it's it's a little too strong for true solo. And I, I get it. You'll see how strong it is in these two games. Uh, again, one against Ronin, one against Venom Goblin. Um, but I'll put down a deck list. I don't know if it'll be the one I specifically used, or it will give you a rough idea of something you can use in case you're interested in playing this way. Uh, but I just used Domino and I just threw this deck together and you can see how powerful it can be. Now, really quick note, I will mention that there might be slight rules errors and I apologize for that because I was doing this very, very quickly, uh, but it shouldn't have made a difference in the outcome of the game. Uh, but with Ronin, we took out his modular, we took out the, um, Cree Command, whatever it's called, a uh, set that's recommended. We put in Bomb Scare instead because I was messing around with some other stuff and I was getting frustrated with it. Um, so we have Bomb Scare, we have Long Shot, and we have the Hope Summers ally in play because we wanted to mess around with that with Ronin, which I do recommend Hope Summers and uh, Al or um, Long Shot in the Inherent deck going against Ronin because it does make things like a little bit easier. It can make things a little bit better for you. So it's definitely worth checking out. And then on Venom Goblin, it's just the recommended stuff. Whatever they recommend to, to play them, that, that's what I did. So uh, hopefully you enjoyed these videos. Do me a huge favor over here on YouTube. Make sure you hit the like button, hit subscribe. All that stuff really helps out. And uh, I hope you enjoy the video. One, two, three, four, five, six. It never ends well. <laughs> Guards must one has death focus. Proxy it. All right, so we have Piercing Strike. Ugh, we're going to get rid of those two. We're going to hold on to those two. Okay. Why wouldn't we? Let's use a triple to play Domino's Pistol. We'll switch Pip the Pug or whatever his name is to put our jackpot in. Um, Let us flip up. We're going to switch jackpot with our top card, which is right place, right time. Okay, cool. Hey, who are, how's it going? Ronin is soul crushing. Collector one is just straight annoying. Yeah, I agree. They need to reprint that. I agree. All right, use a double if you're piercing strike. Deals three damage. One, two, three. Max is tough off as well. Um, Let's actually use right place, right time. Milana to put in sharpshooter. Okay. Hope, 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 hope. Is going to deal three damage. One, two, three. Domino's pistol is going to deal okay. Three damage. One, two, three. This just means how brutal. Uh this is just modular. Space power and cream militants are pretty horrifying. Yeah. Agreed. Alright, sharpshooter now is another two. Two. And then we can three one two three all right next stage let's just let's just why not why not let's ready up we have to look for cut the power man long shots on the bottom cut the power do a reward and support group <laughs> everyone gets it we all get it i might just say Hi, Ted. <laughs> Can we go to 18? Okay. One, two, three, four, five. Big attacks, big attacks. Luck be a lady. Good workout. Okay, cool. All right, let's get it by two. We are going to defend this for three against the three. So he's swinging one. Power stone onto him. So it's two damage he does. Or he does, yeah, two damage. One, two. That's fine. Two bad cards. You're confused. No, that's fine. <laughs> I'm not even I'm not even worrying about threat at this point. <sighs> Alright, we're gonna cancel that. For sure. Use painted lady, exhaust the Milana. We cancel that. Okay, cool. Cancel the effects. Okay. Fun. 
All right, so now it's our turn. He has tough. I'm going to switch the top card of White Fox against Deadpool. That's fine. Um, Let's use Hope to deal the ping that we need. All right, we're going to throw away Deadpool and Lucky and Good to play a good workout. Deals four damage. One, two, three, four. And five damage. Now, White Fox can do a damage. Oh, wait, wait. We get the stone, right? White Fox can do a damage. All right. So that was one damage done with Villain. Uh, with White Fox, sorry. Um, Domino's Pistol is going to deal one plus Sharpshooter is two, three. One, two, three. Okay. Now we can flip down and ready up. Hold on to Luck Bailey. Two, three, four, five, six. Okay, cool. Got him. All right. We did a sharpshooter, right? With Domino's pistol? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Lacking in 4K. I know, exactly. All right. Two onto there. He's going to scheme for two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'll, and he schemes for a lot. Uh, attach the power stone to the Ronin. That's fine. Comes with one. Two bad cards. Uh, we'll place one threat in the main scheme. That's fine. Guard gain surge. That's fine. Hey, long shot. <laughs> uh, put long shot in the player under your control. This card gains surge. Okay. Uh, exhaust them below. That's fine. Okay, so now we just win. Right? Now we just win. Now we just win. So let us flip up. Hey, Drew, how's it going? All right, gains piercing, which is so nice. Just everything is so nice right now. Let's use aggressive energy and symbiote suit to play clobber. Deal three damage. One, two, three. Get our card back. Hey, that's fine. We can switch digging deep with the top card, which is outlaw. Okay. We could throw away clobber. To play luck be a lady and it's oh look it's this so we could deal three damage one two three deal another three damage one two three okay we have now one so but more importantly we could throw away these two to do piercing strike one two three and then we can attack for two one two hope can deal i think we did enough to get the stone back so hope can deal three damage one two three uh white fox can deal another damage one long shot can deal two one two Domino's Pistol can do one, two. Sharpshooter can do another one, two. God, he's so easy. We totally didn't spend an hour 51 just playing him. First time. Shouldn't Clobber do four? Yeah, sure, why not? Probably should have. It's out 16. <laughs> just rush for the win. Two, three, four, five, six. All right, Clobber. Probability field. Another Clobber. Okay. I like double. I like probability field. I like the idea of those two cards together. Now nah, that doesn't make sense because if Clobber is the first card we play, we probably want to do probability field because we can get that in for free basically. So we'll do Iron Heart. So we'll get rid of these. <laughs> Four, five, six. Okay. So let's use a double. We're just, we're just going to run through this and see how this goes. Use a double to play probability field. We can throw away, or not throw away, we can switch double with lucky break. Um, we'll flip up to other side. We can put digging deep in, switch it with the top card, which is a good workout. Okay. Not what I was thinking I was going to do, but okay. I'm going to attack for two, three, four damage. Two, three, four damage. I can use a double to play Ironheart, draw a card, which is the, okay. Don't, that's not what I was thinking was going to happen, but sure. Um, hmm. I think I'm actually going to throw away 
two cards to play Domino's Pistol then. We'll hold on to a good workout. We'll use Iron Heart to deal one damage on the Venom Goblin. And then the pistols will exhaust and deal two damage. One, two. Okay, you're getting Venom Goblin. Just... Just size <laughs> Alright, let's ready up. I'm gonna hold on to a good workout because we're gonna punch him in the face soon. Two, three, four, five. Okay. It's been legit too. Ah, uh, the board game? I never played it. It looked it looked it looked fun though. Alright, so three. So he's going to attack. Ironheart's gonna take the hit, so it's gonna be two, three damage. Ironheart doesn't make it. Sad Ironheart is sad. Now, after Venom Goblin activates against you, move the counter to the scheme of the least threat. Okay, upper Manhattan. We can add to or resolve its special ability. I'll just add to. That's fine. All right, back guard. It's a switch game. Well, it's a board game too. <sighs> I think I have it on Steam. Limitless supply. Each tech attachment gains surge. Okay, that's cool. Well, they made a monster hunter. I don't know if it's rise, to be fair. Okay. I think that's the most interesting to play by far. I actually think Venom Goblin's like not terrible. Well, I mean, like he's hard, but he's not like. Like he's fun to play, is what I would say. Alright, I like the idea of Wolverine. But at the same time, I don't. Alright, let's use. Let's switch out X Gene with the top card, which is a power of aggression. Actually, that's not terrible. Because so we could do two, four, put in that. Okay, we're going to use Power of Regression and a double to put in a Wolverine. Um, we are going to throw away a good workout to play Lucky and Good. Let us, what's he have, nine life left? All right, so we'll do two, three, four damage. One, two, three, four damage. <laughs> All right, um... Wolverine's gonna deal. Nah, he's not gonna deal. Then uh, pistol's gonna be used. Just two more. One, two. And then we're gonna deal three damage. Get the next Venom Goblin stage. And I might actually flip down. So he comes with steady and tough. Deal two face down and counter cards. Do we flip down? I think we flip down and we hope for the best. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. We're ready up. But it shows my message a second time or if it's just me. That's right if it does. Loki is sadistic. Yeah, Loki I just don't like at all. Like super late game and their ally goes down with a light breeze. <laughs> All right, so do we want to actually flip down? If he schemes a lot, does it really matter? Yeah, we're going to flip down. All right, so he comes in with 18. Okay, we're going to draw back up. So it's 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Wait, was that too many? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. No, that was good. All right, so this goes up. 1, 1, 1. Now he's going to scheme onto Upper Manhattan for two, three, four. So that brings up to eight. Now, after Venom Goblin activates against you, move the glider to the main scheme with the least threat and resolve its special ability. So that's the least. So it's special says place one threat on each scheme. One, one, one. Now we get one normal back card and another back card. So we have to deal four. Ooh. One subscriber. That's so weird. As long as you don't see ads. <laughs> okay, we are one. I think that's fine. I think that's fine. That, that's that's fine. Uh. Okay, that's fine. We're gonna just we're just gonna ignore him too. That's 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 cool. Okay, this card gains surge. Shoot. All right, we do need to kill that. 
Oh, okay, we need to kill that too. That's not great. That makes things a little tougher. Okay. Um, hmm. Let's think about this. I don't know if I could take out both. It feels like a lot. It would have been nice to have Venom on the table. Because that would have been a decent amount. Nah, actually that would not have been a decent amount of things. It would have been a very few things actually. Hmm. <laughs> um. Alright, so we posse and digging deep to play the other pistol. I'm going to switch out digging deep with Venom. We flip up. I'm going to switch digging deep with the top card, which is outlaw. Okay. Kind of stinks, but sure. Um, okay. So we have to get, uh, he heals one. We have to get rid of enraged symbiote. So we'll use the pistol deals two damage. Gets rid of him. Now we have to get rid of this one as well. Uh, we don't do any of that. I can do Digging deep. I could do these three to put an outlaw. Which comes in with top four. We have nine life. Uh, oh. Alright, let's attack Thrall with two. Three, four damage knocks him out. Cool. We can do piercing and three damage. One, two, three. Then we can use the other pistol to hit the jackpot. One, two, three. Get into Venom everything. I know, right? <laughs> okay. What we can do... What does he have? 12 life left? Wolverine could take the hit. Like, if this pops, it's not the worst thing. We just can't have another one pop. He's going to get two bad cards, which stinks, but that's okay. This is going to deal three damage, which I don't care about. Wolverine will probably take a hit. Nah, we'll keep it. We'll keep it. All right, well, we're going to stay like this. This is fine. Draw five. One, two, three, four, five. All right. Sharpshirt. Luck be a lady, which is nice. Clobber. Okay. So we can switch to digging deep. This is pretty good. Spent way more than 100 bits. Guess not. <laughs> One, one. Okay, so this advances. Move the glider counter and each acceleration token from here to the main scheme with the least. Okay, so it's still on the least. That's fine. Now, Venom Goblin is going to attack. We're going to let it get hit with a tough. So it's going to be six if you are stunned. Or no, you are stunned. Knocks off the tough. Counter moves there. We place one threat into each scheme. One goes there. One goes there. He's going to deal three damage. One, two, three. And we take two bad cards. What can go wrong? No one likes Upper Manhattan. If you've been there, it's... it's oh, okay. If Advanced Glider is in play, the villain activates you. If not, we look for Advanced Glider. And add to him. Alright. So he gets Advanced Glider. We don't even care about that because we're just trying to win at this point. Don't be something that activates against us. Okay. That's fine. <laughs> Alright. One reveals searching the encounter deck and discard pile out and set aside area for superpower feedback. Oh, wait. We have to attach it to our identity. Sorry. Where is it? Oh, there it is. Alright. After resolve, we take a damage. That's fine. Uh, place two threat there, so it's going to be five onto there. Hold on, wait, wait, wait. They get an extra ability with that symbiote environment in play? Oh, shoot. Who'd I miss? This guy? He just has quick strike. Is there anything else that I missed? Thank you. 
No, but tech attachments gain surge. We had to reveal it. So we're supposed to get one more bad card because tech attachments gain surge and it was revealed. Oh, you're right, you're right. Uh, we placed one additional threat. Sorry, so sorry. You're right. Okay, so this is supposed to gain surge because of the tech, and I forgot about limitless supply. Retaliate, steady toughness. Play, he gets okay. I don't I don't even care about that. None of those things matter to me. <laughs> so that's fine. <laughs> All right, let us let's see how it goes. Place one threat in each scheme. Symbios uh, place one additional threat. Oh, on yeah, it was just on this scheme. Sorry, it just says on this scheme. All right, so it's supposed to be that. Steady toughness retaliate. We could put the tough on him. We could put the steady on him. It doesn't matter because we have to just do twelve damage. Okay. So what we're going to do is switch the top card, Digging Deep, with Uppercut. That's fine. So if, chat, if I use Clobber to take off my stun, do I get Clobber back because I played the card or not? I don't know how that works. I don't think it really matters. You don't because it just cancels it, right? Because you're not actually doing the card, basically. But we can still do it so it clears our stun, which is probably what we're going to do. The whole effect is replaced by the stun. Okay, okay, cool. Thank you. But let's do that regardless. We'll throw away two cards to do clobber so that it's an attack action, clears the stun. All right, might as well clone that out. All right, clear that out. I could, but I'd rather exhaust. Because what we're going to do is we're going to throw away Sharpshooter to play Luck Be a Lady. It's going to be, oh, look at that. So we could deal six damage to Venom Goblin. One, two, three, four, five, six. Cool. Also, Wolverine should have healed one. Wolverine is going to deal three damage to knock himself out. Is a Nemesis attachment? This one? No. I just take damage. I have to resolve the ability on your identity or an identity specific card. Um, so, resolve their ability. That's one damage. Two, three damage. Right? Wolverine does three. Did we do Wolverine's three? All right. So Wolverine knocks himself out. Does three damage. One, two, three. Cool. And then we do two, three damage. One, two, three. We resolve our text box. So we take a damage. We won. White Fox can then ex exhaust the deal of damage, which is cool. They got maxed up. Nah, it's all good. I think, like, oh, uh, yeah, I don't remember who that is. We just took a lot of damage, is all. Venom Goblin is super easy. Super, super easy. Probably the easiest card in the game, honestly. Just, just simple, really. <laughs> 